At first, when I heard from Liu Hong that you were reluctant to come, I thought you didn't want to take on tasks from the organization. That's not the case, mainly because the fruits in my greenhouse are ripe, and I'm in a hurry to sell them, but since I've brought them all the way to Yanjing, if I can't sell them, you'll have to buy them from me. You kid, you are really. It's the first time I've seen a billionaire selling fruits. All right, let's end it here for today. I'm going back to get some sleep. I'll take you back. You are. This is Lin Yi. We both just talked for a while. He is Lin Yi. Come in and have a seat. I'll go buy some food. We'll have dinner together before you leave. It's the first time we met, but the old lady is too enthusiastic. I'm not going to eat, I have other things to do this afternoon, so I'll leave. If you have something to do, I won't keep you, and you can come back when you have nothing to do. Okay. This lady, who is neither a relative nor an acquaintance, why is she so nice to me? Hello. Are you team leader Lin? My name is Zhang Baoshan. Mr. Lu mentioned that you have some fruits you want to sell and asked me to come and help. Is there anything specific you need me to do? I understand that you want to go to Wangfu Jing Street, but it seems that setting up a stall there might not be allowed. Can you help me arrange a stall? This is no problem. Let's exchange Weshit contact information. I'll help you arrange it right away. You can head to Wangfu Jing Street, and once the arrangements are made, I'll send you the location. Okay, thanks for your help. Are you Zhang Baoshan? I am. This is considered the best location in Wangfu Jing Street. It has the highest traffic, so selling things here should be a safe bet. Thank you. These are all pesticide free products, safe to consume. Chief Lin, I can't let you do that. I can't take your things. Don't worry, feel free to eat. No one dares to interfere with you. If anything happens, I'll take responsibility.
Then I'll leave now, and you can call me if you need anything. Okay. The man who sells fruits is so handsome. What's the use of being handsome? He's just a fruit vendor. The money he earns in a month wouldn't even be enough for you to buy a pair of shoes. You're right, but I think his fruits look fresh. I want to buy some and have them for myself. Let's go then. I haven't had lychee for a long time either. It's so sweet. My friend, how much is your lychee? Give me five kilograms, please. Three thousand per kilogram, so it will be fifteen thousand in total. You can just scan the QR code to complete the payment. What did you say? 3,000 yuan per kilogram. You didn't hear it wrong. It's indeed 3,000 yuan per kilogram. The taste, as you have experienced, is worth every penny according to those who have tried it. Did you raise the price after seeing me eat one? Are you trying to deceive me here? If you can't afford it, just say so. I'm not trying to force you into buying anything. But you had one lychee, which would be around 100 yuan based on the price. If you can't afford to buy 5 pounds, then just pay for the price of this one. What if I don't want to pay? Let's give him the money and consider it as charity. Don't worry, I'll give him the money. However, I don't have cash with me, so I'll need to call my friends and ask them to bring some over. It just so happens that they have opened a new store nearby. I'll make a phone call, and they can come over in just a few minutes. Stay here and don't leave. I'll have them arrive with the money. I am here selling fruits. Why would I leave? Brother Chen, I've been deceived here on Wang Fujing Street. Can you send me some money and bring some people with you? It's better to forget it, it's only 100 yuan. Brother Chen runs a taekwondo gym, if you call him here, there's a risk of causing more damage, and we'll end up paying even more. This is not just about money. I would rather compensate him with a hundred thousand yuan than give him these hundred yuan.
Brother Chen, you're here. Is he the person who deceived you? Yes, I tasted one of his lychees, and then he demanded 100 yuan from me. Do you think that's considered deceiving? Kid, you're quite interesting. How can you even think of doing such a thing? Do you have any idea where you are right now? Did he ask you to come and deliver the money? Is it in cash or should you scan a payment code? Selling this lychee for 3,000 yuan per kilogram. Am I handling it in a way that satisfies you? Do you still want us to pay you? You're going a bit too far with this. 